Hello. Uh, I want to show you a quick video about something that I handmade. Uh, I don't know if everyone, but people have a problem when they have this controller. This is a T10J. Uh, and when they use FPV screen, so they have a problem to connect it on the top of the controller. Uh, now some people use this uh, this uh, gray and they make it but it's not so high so you don't have any uh, way to touch the buttons and use the camera you can still use it but you have to look under and see all the buttons so and also of course you cannot buy from eBay so any anything that you connect on this because this is a plastic and it's a plastic so you cannot use anything uh, now I saw on the uh, internet I saw people that uh, 3D print a piece that you put inside here and but you need to make a hole on top of the controller and put a screw inside and then you can lock it uh, but it costs like $50 or something like that so I look on YouTube and I find some uh, some guy give me ID how to make a very cheap one surprise the cheap one and to make it connect uh, the screen on top of this uh, this um, handle so I come up with the ID and I make this piece now this piece is made of wood and uh, then uh, one screw here and uh, this here I put a hitch ring just on here, the part that sits on the top of the handle so it was very easy to use uh, it's like a very cheap, just a piece of wood and little tools and stuff but I'm going to show you how it's uh, how I connect it, one sec first you take the controller and then you take the screen and you put this piece under here like that and then you connect it like this And then you can see the screen is connected. This is how it looks on the back. One screw here. Of course, I make a hatch here and there, so it's this wood not going to move. But uh, it's very nice, and also you can use a uh, cover for the shadow, so you can have shadow on the screen. But this is very solid and nice. It's not move. Uh, and everyone with a little creativity can make any design uh, you want just a piece of wood and a screw and uh, and of course this one I so I be able to close it and open it very easy just with the, with a hand I make this screw this is a normal screw with a line right and I took a piece of a uh, Flexiglass, it's like a pl plastic. I cut some uh, shape like this with my tools, put it inside uh, something that push it together, and I use a heat gun on this point. And slowly, slowly, I close it and close it and close it. When I use the heat gun, and it's going to the plastic, melt the plastic, and it's going all the way. And that's why you can use it. So it's very strong. And then I paint it with a little paint so black paint so i think it's very easy and it's very cheap uh, i did order the one for fifty dollar but uh, my luck he didn't send it yet so i cancel it because i pay with paypal so i got the money back but it's very easy you just need someone to give you id and then you can create anything you want so basically this i mark it so it sits like this inside and this one piece hit on the bottom of the 
screen. And uh, yeah, so it's very easy to make. Just uh, think a little, and you can make yourself your own mount for the T10J controller. Hope you like it. Thank you very much for watching.